You are watching Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I am your host, Phil Wesley, the Mile High Mouth, and today we're going to take a look at Spellcrafts and Circles release of Fly High Works. Um, let's see. Oh, my and Delight. There's a bunch in here attached to it. But we're talking about Pan Pan. I know this was released a while back, actually recently like got back into it, finished it off, and I was like, oh yeah, I should uh, mention this game. I should tell people about this game. And let me explain why I should tell you about this game. Hmm. Let's go into a new game, actually. Here. This game is incredibly relaxing. And it's actually one of the better bargains on the Nintendo eShop because this is a game, I mean, it might take some people um, four, three to four hours to complete um, if they're really intuitive, but most people will look at this kind of the same way that they did Myst. Or, uh, what was that other one? The Witness. Yeah. This is like Katamari Damashi meets The Witness and, uh, um, What is the other game I mentioned? There's The Witness, Katamari Damashi, and Mist. Yeah, I, I don't really think Mist is that good, actually. I love the music in the Mist games, but not really a big fan of the Mist games in general, because you can beat the whole thing in like 15 minutes. Basic idea here in Pan Pan, though, is you are this character right here who has been um, stranded on some remote rock. Ed, you crashed. Like, <laughs> and your character dies, and it's the end of the game. No, actually, you got you got fixed. There's these two or like, and uh, we're gonna set this little healing thing up for you. And here you go. It just throws you into it. You can control the camera. And you can uh, walk around a little bit. Yay, get away from me, things. And then you can, um, well, interact with things. Oh, that's a safe spot, by the way. What's kind of interesting about this game is that, uh, it's, it's pretty calm. Let me uh, turn my volume over here save it, it's kind of relaxing let's go talk and see what these people want nope hit the A button you have to find little parts like you need to find a part that goes here you need to fill this up with something find the part that goes here and here and here mm-hmm these people will be like, here's what we're looking for. So you gotta explore the land around here. You'll find items. I'm not gonna say what they are. Wah. <laughs> Anyways. As you move along, you'll slowly uncover all sorts of new places things to do and you can get stuff like uh, at some point you'll find a stick and you can use it to kind of cut things or hit things and you'd be amazed what you can do with the stuff actually let me let me solve a sample puzzle to let people know what this is it really has no combat there's no real violence in this it's all about being the best at all this. Oh, here's the thing with four gems. Hmm, what do we do with these? Well, we saw these things. Oh, this thing lights that up, doesn't it? Does it light up this? Nope. But this lights up, so that's a uh, hexagon. Hmm. Maybe we're supposed to put these in this order over here. 
on top of this. See, that's the type of puzzles you'll find in this game. And then there's new intuitive things that you find, and they're like, oh, this... Like, for example, when you find the little stick, it um, changes quite a bit of dynamics, because then you can knock over things and break pots and things like that, or hit trees and stuff, and it's it's actually pretty cool. I think that was uh, this one, right? I think it was the little hourglass. I gotta set the hourglass down. It also looks fantastic. Love the art style of this game. Oh, that one's the uh, diamond. My yellow diamond! And I guess that would make this last one uh, this. Don't even have to deal with it. Uh huh. save but yeah there's all sorts of weird little um I'm not gonna show you some of the more complex ones see these things I can't do anything with those because I don't have a thing that uh oh, wait hmm yes that seems to be working okay follow me weird little yellow things yes okay hmm We'll just get like a part from here, I think. <laughs> and this should give me a part of some sort. Yep. And there's a part. I don't think this is a part for the ship though. Oh, I'm using the A button to lift things, and using this thing to get a better view of my surroundings. This game is fun and surprising, actually. Really good art style, pretty relaxing music, and um, just a relaxing and fun game overall. Hmm. I need this to go down. How do I get this down? Uh-oh. Hmm. What do I do? Nope. Hmm. Hmm. There's these rocks in the way. Hmm. Okay, I had this. Is there anything I can do with uh, with this? Nope. Hmm. Can I put this in here? Nope. Won't let me. No, she'll chide me for trying it. Hmm. Hmm. I need to get this down there. Can I push these? No, nothing happens there. I need to get that down there. Well, let's see. Let's get up on the uh, ladder. I kind of love how this game looks. What about this? Oh, I need that. I need... I need that in my life. So I need this. And I need these. Hmm. How do I get that down from there? Come on. You're supposed to come with me. Actually, it's been a while since I, like... I mean, since I finish this puzzle so I'm just like no maybe no how do I how do I get this down there crud hmm well that's pan pan for you I mean there's a stick in there I need that stick maybe there's some 
at least something yet. Back the Right? I'll do with this. Okay. Let's put that down. Hmm. I'm trying to remember what I'm supposed to do at this point. Hmm. Oh, there's an item to get. What's over here? Hmm. Other things. Other puzzles. I mean, after all, that's what this game is. It's just puzzles. If you're a fan of puzzles, you, you kind of need this game in your life. It loves you. You need it. Okay, let me move this over here. Nope. Huh. Sweet. I'll take this with me. Yay. Now that that's open all the time. can take this one and I'll put it there. <laughs> and taking this. And saving. But yeah, um this is Pan Pan. It's a game that's really relaxing. Um it's a little bit of a puzzle game. If you're a fan of those types of puzzles and you want to check out how to, you know, play this or you want to check it out, you know, I definitely recommend it. It's cheap. It's pretty sweet. I liked it. Um, the ending is good. The whole narrative of it is pretty good, too. Just a really fun game that kind of transcends borders. And if you're a person who loves puzzle games, you're going to love this. And you'll be thinking about it for a little while. It's worth it. But yeah, um, I just wanted to show people uh, Pan Pan. What do you guys think? Hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. Hit that share button if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And make sure that whenever you hit that subscribe button that you rock that little bell so that you are notified whenever we have a brand new video here on area dmg i know you've been a little bit behind but we have a bunch of stuff coming up so let me let me know you know hit that thing so you're in the know okay and until the next video comes out you are now caught up